to the Entertain Talking Sports. What is going on, football fans? Back at it with another New York Giants video. And in this video, I'm going to talk about the rumors that have leaked from Bleacher Report uh, by senior writer Matt Miller regarding Isaiah Simmons, the linebacker prospect out of Clemson. Uh, these actually came out yesterday, I think, or maybe even two days ago. I decided not to make a video on it. They've now resurfaced on Twitter, and a number of my subscribers, both on Twitter and YouTube, have asked me to do a video on it. And you know what? At the end of the day, when people want me to do a video, my subscribers want me to do a video, I'm going to report on it. And of course, Isaiah Simmons is the most popular draft prospect that may be coming to the New York Giants this year. I've been pretty outspoken that I'd be fine with either an offensive tackle or Simmons. Pretty much anyone else at that spot, I will not be happy. Isaiah Simmons, I've done, you know, several videos on him. I'm incredibly impressed with his versatility. And, you know, when Joe Judge came out with his initial press conference, the first player that popped in my head, I say it time and time and time again, is Isaiah Simmons uh, because he expressed versatility. He wants a defense that you can't predict for, and there's nobody more versatile in this year's draft. Isaiah Simmons out of Clemson was phenomenal this year. He had like seven or eight sacks. He played every position known to man outside of like defensive tackle. Um, and I think that's why Giants fans are super excited about him. He then went on to have a super combine where he ran a 4 3 9 40. He excelled in every, you know, every test thrown his way. And that's why, you know, he sort up draft charts and he's definitely on the New York Giants radar and is a great modern day linebacker. And we're going to jump into some of the quotes that was reported by Matt Miller of Bleach Report. I also want to get into some of his credentials um, and my thoughts on potentially taking him over the offensive tackle. And if they do that, where I think the New York Giants could be going, you know, with the remainder of their picks. But let's jump into some of the quotes from Bleach Report. First, there was this. This uh, came out, I think, yesterday on uh, Twitter from Bleach Report. Rumor, the Giants are zeroing in on Isaiah Simmons. Many NFL scouts believe Big Blue will take Clemson's do-it-all defender, Isaiah Simmons, with the number four pick. Simmons, who played linebacker, corner, and safety, is Matt Miller's number four ranked prospect. Then I wanted to pull up Matt Miller's, you know, Twitter resume so you guys know you're getting some, some you know, information from someone credible. Um, like I said, he's been writing for Bleacher Report since 2010. He has 239,000 Twitter followers. So, seems pretty credible to me. He's a pretty big name. This was a tweet that came out from WBG84. I wanted to give him a quick shout out. Um, he's always posted Giants news on Twitter. And he said, according to NFL Draft Scout, who is Matt Miller, that's his Twitter handle, a lot of people in the Giants building want Clemson linebacker Isaiah Simmons. Then this was his exact answer when asked it in his mailbag segment on, on Bleach Report. He was asked, are the Giants going to draft a blocker, Isaiah Simmons, or trade down? He went on to say, I've heard they love Simmons and a lot of people in the building want him. So there you have it. If this is true, if Matt Miller is telling the truth, it seems as if Isaiah Simmons is certainly on the New York Giants' radar. And if free agency taught us anything, the New York Giants coaching staff is going to have a lot to do with this selection. I've said it time and time again. Every one of these free agent acquisitions outside of James Bradbury, I think, was coach-influenced. Uh, I don't even think it's a debate. The, the whole coaching staff was a complete plan and seems as if it was influenced by Joe Judge. They all had connections, for the most part, to Joe Judge. And if Joe Judge wants Isaiah Simmons... I think there's a strong chance they take him. The other thing I'll say, like I've said many times, if none of these offensive tackles stand out to the point where they feel they're an all-pro player, where they think they're four really good tackles, even though you could definitely argue, and I've argued several times, it might be a more pressing need for, need for the New York Giants, but Gettleman feels that this guy's a gold jacket player. He's shown in the past that he is willing to take a player that you know he feels is a slam dunk prospect, even though it may not fill the biggest need. You go back to 2018, running back was a need, but it was definitely not our biggest need, and he took Saquon Barkley with that pick. If he feels that Isaiah Simmons is a gold jacket prospect, I think Gettleman could definitely take him. I've said it all along. I think it'll be Simmons or I think it'll be a tackle. And according to Matt Miller, it's starting to lean the way of Simmons. Now, of course, in free agency, the New York Giants certainly addressed the linebacker position. They re-signed David Mayo, and of course, they brought in Blake Martinez, who I mistakenly said Nick Martinez yesterday, and you guys made sure to let me know about it. <laughs> but... You know, we'll have to wait and see. No, neither one of those guys are known to be great in coverage. Martinez, of course, did better in that aspect with Graham. I think that's a big reason why they brought him in. They think that he could definitely improve in that aspect, probably with the Giants coaching staff. But a guy like Simmons would bring a lot of versatility, not just back, not just at the linebacker spot. You could play him some at safety. You could play him some in the slot. He'd be able to move Julian Love around a little bit more, and he'd fill a lot of our holes on our defense. Now, if we were to take him, I think it would almost force 
the New York Giants to address the tackle position in round two. And if they didn't, I think it would have to be a center. You need to fill in at least one offensive line spot in the first two rounds in this year's draft. I've been pretty outspoken that I think it should be the first. I'm not going to cry if we take Isaiah Simmons. I completely recognize we have not drafted a first-round linebacker since 1984. That position has been a revolving door. The last middle linebacker we could really count on was Antonio Pierce. Simmons is not your traditional middle linebacker, but he might be the modern-day linebacker and the type of linebacker that teams are looking for in the future. A guy that could take away the slot receiver, the tight end up the middle, that could get after the quarterback, and he'd bring a lot of value to this New York Giants football team. We're going to have to wait and see if these rumors are true as the draft is only about two and a half to three weeks away. And if the Giants stamp at it number four, at least according to Matt Miller, it seems like Isaiah Simmons may very well be their man. As always, guys, if you like what you watch, please subscribe, drop a comment, maybe give me a little thumbs up. Cheers.